Previously on African Knockouts, a beauty queen transforms the training ground into a runway and an explosive matchup ends in tears for the Okechi brothers. The teams race for supremacy with a truck weighing them down, then later had some fun on the beach with the girls. An early knockdown turns into a knockout and the Dembe exhibition leads to a heated discussion in camp. You bring, no vex, so where you keep this thing? I choose MMA as my career is because I want to be a world champion. I want to surprise my classmates, people that we knew before in primary and secondary school, everybody I knew in my life, my parents, everyone I know. I wanted to become a colonel in Hami. The name my parents give to me is Seripre, and they call me Thomas. I changed my name to Colonel Thompson. When I was a little kid in our family, I was the weakest. I was born the weakest, even though I didn't even know that I would be the tallest. In everything you do, you have to be the best. Try to be the best. One, two, three, come on. Hey, come on, go. Colonel come on. is a good fighter. And I have my reasons why preserving him till this hour. At the end, he's going to deliver. And I so much believe in him. Uh, my opponent is a National Sport Festival gold medalist, and I'm taking him down for knockout. So, course is a promise. That's right, slave boy. Sir, boy. You, know, you have to kill me for me to give up. You have to kill me. You, I, I have to be unconscious because I will never give up. So, all my fights, I always move forward. Jubrin, the black venom. He's the last man standing in the White Wolf crew, and he's been going head to head with Colonel Thompson. And this is a fight you need to watch. We need to give the Black Venom all moral support. It's right? But you also owe us a victory. Yes. The battle line is drawn already. Boy, you're good to go. Always remember, we sweat hard on training just to bleed less in battle. Yes. Okay? Only a few hours from the last fight of the common tournament, the two coaches meet up to weigh their fighters. That's all. We're back again. Telling you. So what's happening now? I'm good, bro. You're chilling, looking at uh, chilling, looking the at, nature is around. At the venue. When the next battle is going to happen. So I hope like, you're not surprised. Where will I be? My black venom is good to go. You see I know anything? you have your marine boxer, but man. Definitely. The only civilian come on, combat strategies we are. You're going to see a BS in functions tomorrow. I just have two things for my boy to give to your boy and see how the fight will look like. Woo! Just two things. <laughs> I'm laughing in Chinese, man. <laughs> <laughs> I know what my boy is going to do to you, Just your boy. two things. Don't worry. You know what? Right thing. now, I'm holding you because I'm on four to two now. Do you know what? I'm about thing. giving you five to two. Do you know one thing? Five to two. I don't two. do too much talk. Let's get into I the understand. cage. Ladies and gentlemen, for the main event in the black corner, from Delta State, weighing 75 kilograms, a vicious boxer with him still, Colonel Thompson, aka the Marine Boxer. What you are expecting to see from me is a cool professional fight. In the yellow corner, representing the White Wolves from Cano State, weighing at 77 kilograms. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome Jibril Inua Baba. AKA the Black Venom! I'm a kind of guy that creates chaos. I'm cool outside, but when I'm inside, I'm very bad. You know? And the fight is underway. The Marine Boxer in the Black Corner and the Black Venom in the Yellow One. Watch, watch. 
Canal scores a takedown and goes into side control. He could look for submission openings or attempt the transition into full mount in search of some ground and pound. Jibril ends the first round defending from his back. Like Anoja is saying, the Marine boxer probably just back round one. You can do it. You can do it. This one, no, take him as my woman up for me. You understand? Take him as my woman up for me. It's the second round. Jibril needs to bring it unless he'll find himself drowning in the Marine boxer's fists. Watch calculation. Fuck it. Bob! Something dead here. Bob! Something dead here. Carry on, come here. Bob! Carry on, come here. No go down here. Good, Good boy. boy. Good boy. Good boy. Come here. Connell scores another easy takedown. Coach Mania wouldn't be happy about it. Come here. Punch on there. Roshan, take him back! Good boy! Good it is not boy, looking good, good for Jibril. And good if Cornell takes his back, it will he get turn around, much worse. Turn around. He's done! He's done! Good boy! Good boy! Full mount! Full mount! Full mount! Full mount! Good boy! Cornell listens to his coach and transitions into full mount. The Marine boxer just Marine looks head, like head. he wants it more right Don't now. Don't split your leg! Don't split your leg! Kneels down! Keep Kneels up. down! Keep up. Kneels down! News down! Yeah. Uh, that's a Push! Lie. Mount! Mount! Hold your leg under his arm! Jubri! Like that! Keep punching! Keep doing your work! Jubri! Do your work! Oh, yeah, you move your right hand and punch! You are doing it! You are doing it! Nothing to do from there! Come on, Jubri! You breathe. Punch. Come up. Hold those guts. Hold those guts. Hold them. Hold them. You breathe. You breathe. Hold them. Thank you. Jibril just turns his back That's on Cornell, who should be Punish looking you. to slide on top of Jibril and get his hooks in for a back mount. Cornell, however, continues walking from his current position, and Jibril looks content to remain called up and roll with the punches. Stand up. Tell him, Jubri, stand up! Don't stay there too long! Punish him in his front there! There's already a bit of blood on the arena, and Jibrin will have to start protecting himself better if he doesn't want to add to it. He's probably two rounds down, and will have to submit or knock out Cornell to win this fight. But does he have it in him? I told you. I told you. Bob! Bob! Find it! Find you. it! Uh -huh. Jibril boy. attempts Good a kick, boy. but Cornell shoots for Good the takedown and executes easily. Punish this is down. familiar territory for both there. fighters. Close the second eye. Separate him! Separate him! Separate! Separate! Jibri, 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 talk, yeah, talk, good talk. boy, good boy, that is it. Punish him, that is it. Jibri gives Cornell his back again. This white wolf may have lost his mojo, and there's nothing Coach Mania can do about it. Please, show them you can do it. Show his thoughts you can do it. Jibri, you are the best. You are the best. Clinch, clinch, hold. And the third round, the fight is over. The Marine Boxer lets the White Wolves know what he thinks of Black Venom's potency. I am the forbidden meat. The king of MMA, yeah, boy. the marine boxer, yeah, boy. the dedicated stone. Yeah, boy.
you. Yeah, I'm gonna you. I feel I like won this fight is because of what I get inside me. It's all about, it's not all about power. It's not all about muscle, like I said before. It's about the skill and the core is living inside you. Performance was bad actually because I felt so weak today. So I don't know what happens. Sometimes we have a bad day, so that's. But I didn't give up, so I don't give up. By unanimous decision, ladies and gentlemen, the winner is Cornell Thompson. The boy has made me proud. Everything is going according to plan. We're out to do more without making noise. To me, Jibri's coach didn't do well. Blood was spilled on the cage and his eyes are closed. He's supposed to throw towel. Give up. To me, throwing a towel for a warrior like uh, Jibri is not necessary. He's a survivor. You know, you always learn by mistakes. You know, uh, he's some, sometimes you start you start like beating people, beating people. When you cr start crashing, you crash down. And then it's better that you start with lost, then you learn more from lost. Yeah, before the fight, um, I think um, Jubrin and Didi came out mostly late at night and they were both working out. And I think his situation was uh, fatigue. 